We are out on a walk. We found a uh, off-leash dog trail parky thing. And uh, there's like nobody out here today. And it's wonderful. I saw this thing last night online. It was a meme of some sort talking about how in Japan they've got something called tree therapy. I don't know if it's actually called that, but essentially you're prescribed to go out in nature uh, and um, the smell of trees is supposed to relieve stress, some sort of neurological thing. I know I'm explaining this really well, but basically trees are therapy and uh, I have to say I agree. Every time we're out here, I just feel better. Like, there's so many things right now that are stressing me out, but just coming out into nature and walking around and smelling trees and grass and stuff, it does wonders for the mind. So, here we are. It's a lovely day. It's about... Um, 90 degrees or something right now, but we're, uh, we're in the shade here a lot of the way, so it's really not that bad. It's probably like 80 or something. What'd you find? Did you find a tree? Imagine that. That giant spider web. Wow. I'm right here. Thanks for waiting. It was very nice of you. <laughs> okay. I'm not too sure what this is. There are several markers. I'm guessing maybe it's like a trail marker, like, um, cause there are various maps, uh, for this place. So maybe one of them is color coded. And, uh, that's what the blue and purple and pink are. I don't know. Okay, but here's a fancy one. I think it's just people painting trees because they think they're cool. I don't know. It's a lot of colors. A little creek that extends back into that area there. I'm not sure why this water is so cloudy. It sure is, though. And there's some more. It's like almost a rainbow right there. Hmm. Okay, so the majority of these are red and blue. Uh, so I think there's an agenda. Still not sure, though. More red and blue. Or maybe it's just that they uh, only had red and blue ink. Or spray paint, or whatever. Moose. What do you think? There's another blue one. There's a purple one. Or pink, sort of. It's definitely more magenta than anything else. What are you? There's an orange one. So yeah, I've uh, concluded that it's just a bunch of kids with spray paint cans being jerks. They're all over the place. Why? Oh yeah, this one's edgy.
we've gone half a mile so far. Go over this bridge. Come in. Such cloudy water. What is happening? Imagine it's like. Calcium of some sort, maybe? What makes water cloudy? It is so muddy out here, bud. It's from the rain that we've gotten over the past couple days. Like the spurts of rain shower that don't last very long. Yeah, this is the real hot part of the walk. Where it's just sunshine and Zeus goes into the shade <laughs> Zeus do you gravitate to the shade you do don't you it's weird I don't I haven't I haven't seen any reptiles out here but I know they must exist and I guess I've also been out here when it's hot, so, I don't know, I kind of expect to see some lizards or something, but they do not show themselves. But yeah, we've gone about a mile now, and we're getting hot, kind of want some water. Do you want some water? Yeah. Um, so we're gonna wander back to the car and uh, have a productive, hopefully, day. I've got some job stuff that I need to do, and uh, actually, finally got someone that wanted an interview with me. It's a receptionist position at a veterinary hospital. Um, and I'm not really sure what to expect. I do want to finish my degree, so... But it's a vicious cycle because I need money to do that. I'm not going to pull out loans for community college. Um, but yeah, it's a vicious cycle, dude. Need money to go to school. Gotta go to school to get a good job. And, yeah... I'm a victim of the system, so to speak. Um, but anyway, gonna go back home now and get some food and uh, see what else is out there. Oh, there's an Aussie. <laughs> He's a cousin. Hi. It is. Cute. That's a cousin moose. <laughs> they say hi. <laughs> Come in. We gotta go. What are you doing? <laughs> Come on, silly dog. So it's been a few days. Um, I actually went back to this trail a few days later with Rory, um, yesterday, and he explained that those tree trunks that are painted um, are actually done by the city. Uh, they go in and they spray paint the stumps so that sap doesn't seep out of them um, and, you know, cause harm to the tree that way, which makes a lot of sense to me. Uh, I guess some of them get creative and draw, like, angry, ragey faces on some of them, um, little swirls and stuff. I don't know. Or kids go back and do that. I, I don't know. 
But it makes a whole lot of sense to me that uh, they should take precaution. Per <laughs> they should take precaution to um, make sure that the trees aren't suffering as a result of uh, having to cut those limbs. I guess to maintain the integrity of the trail, um, so that people aren't walking through there and crashing their foreheads into tree branches. So that's cool. That's nice of them, I suppose. Uh, I also found out that the cloudiness of the water is due to the clay uh, that resides in those wet areas. Um, yesterday when we were walking around, I actually went over one of the bridges, one of the smaller bridges over one of the uh, creek areas and uh, limestone and clay, rather. And uh, yeah, I, uh, I guess that some moisture had fallen from the sky between when I filmed this and when we went back yesterday. And the spot was really wet and really slippery and I fell straight on my butt. And uh, luckily it didn't hurt myself, but um, I don't know. I've been through trails like that before and um, slipped on some of that, some of that clay stuff, and um, not fallen on my butt. But this time I surely did, and so I like crab walked the rest of the way across this bridge, slipping the whole way, uh, and got rightfully dirty. It was a, uh, it's quite a treat. Um, but yeah, so that's why the that's why the water is cloudy. Um, I don't know. It's better that than something else, I guess. And these here are some hognose snakes. I'd been wanting to draw some for a little bit here since uh, getting our new girl. And um, this Inktober prompt was light. Uh, the word light, and I thought about like a light versus dark theme, uh, and hog noses are definitely in in the uh, in the market of being dark versus light. They're either really really sweet or they're real drama drama noodles. Um, they get real pissy for no reason sometimes. They just want to be left alone. I guess all snakes do that, but hognoses are uh, especially known for being dramatic. Um, so we've got this one at the top being cute and personable and wanting to be held, and uh, the bottom one that just wants to be left alone and seething, uh, looking kind of menacing. Um, this is a mixture of, I guess it's all watercolor. Um, I thought maybe the white part uh, was gouache, but I'm pretty sure it was uh, just white watercolor that I got a little heavier with in some spots. Um, yeah, and then just went over the spots with my pin um, and uh, I fiddled a little bit with with the co um, with the colors in Photoshop at the end just to make things pop out a little bit. So it's like four o'clock and I'm still drinking my coffee of the day. Uh, I woke up at like noon or something. I don't even remember when I went to bed last night, but um, it was late and uh, I guess my body just wanted to sleep until noon today. Um, Zeus woke us up at like seven wanting to be fed We've uh, started feeding him a little earlier in the evening because he starts begging for food, don't you? And, uh, which I guess in turn means that he wakes up earlier than us and wants to be fed, so. Uh, but he, uh, I guess he got the hint after a bit and was like, well, guess my humans are sleeping, so I guess I'll sleep too. And. Uh, and so it was, and so we slept in on this lovely Sunday of Sundays. Um, speaking of Sunday, I think 
I'm going to start doing weekly uploads on Sunday. Um, that's going to force me to draw more and post more. Um, I thought I'd do like some little vlog stuff and uh, as well as a drawing. Um, just because I really like YouTube and I like uploading videos and um, it's kind of made me sad that I've stopped. Not really stopped, but you know, it's like three months between videos sometimes and I don't know, that, that makes me sad. There, There's lots of life to live and places to go and things to see and I want to share those things. So I'm gonna. Um, so setting a goal for myself to upload on Sundays because Sunday is usually my day of just getting my stuff together and finishing product projects and um, yeah, so look forward to that. I'm gonna be showing you my snakes and um, various things that I get into on a weekly basis. So, hope y'all are doing well. Uh, thanks for watching, and uh, I'll see you next week, okay? Okay. Bye.